Hey, how's it going, people? It's me, Missio Pickle, and uh, I'm back here again with another episode of Your Pickle. Yippee! It's been a while. I've done one of these, a couple more, I think. Uh, anyway, nonetheless, I am back with another episode, and I'm in a new state once again. From the last episode of Bullet Pickle, not the last video. I'm, I'm in North Dakota still. Um, yeah, uh, anyway, <clears throat> so what's the food for today, you may ask? Well, you probably aren't going to ask because it's in the- You probably aren't going to ask because it's in the title of this video and the thumbnail. If you are going to ask, then you are very- <clears throat> You're not very observant. You should know what it is. It's candy corn. It's very festive for this time of year. Yay! Yippee! It's Brax candy corn. Uh, I think this is the company that makes the candy hearts on Valentine's Day. Those slap. Now, what is my history with candy corn, you may ask? It's very fitting because I'm in the Midwest and there's a lot of corn up here. A lot of corn. Anyway. What is my history with candy corn, you may ask? Well, when I was a young lad, uh, I used to very much enjoy candy corn. I'm like, oh, it's so good, it's so good. I love it, I love it, I love it. When I, and then I turned like 15 or 16 and I tried it and I'm like, yeah, <laughs> this, is, this is nasty. I don't like this. Yeah, get it out of here. And every year or two since then, I've tried it because I want to enjoy candy corn. I want to like candy corn again. But every year, I try it, and I come to the same conclusion, that it's straight trash, it's nasty, it's garbage, it's disgusting, it ain't good. But I want to like it, I really want to. Now one thing that candy corn really does have going for it is it's aesthetic. One of the most aesthetically pleasing pieces of candy in the face of the earth. Yes, sir! It's got an iconic design with the yellow, orange, and white. And little known fact, actually it's probably pretty well known at this point, that you can stack the kernels and make a corn on the gob with it. That is pretty cool. What other candy can you do that with? I didn't think so. Anyway, let's get into it. I haven't tried one of these in probably a couple of years now. Uh, so I'm going to try one. I'm going to see if I like it or not. If I don't like it, I'm literally just going to like throw this entire bag away. Got it. It's candy corn smell. It's a kernel here. One, one more. One more for the analysis. One more for the analysis. Okay, okay. You know, for the first time in nine years, I'm going to say it's not bad. Now, is it amazing? No, it's not. It's very mediocre, but it ain't bad. What, is it good enough for me to buy it? Yeah, for a video. For my enjoyment? No. No. If it's available, sure. I'll, I'll maybe grab a kernel or two. But, um, yeah, let's get the most important ingredient of this video out. Is it pickle? Fun fact, I bought this exact jar of pickles in Texas, and I am now in North Dakota. So this jar has traveled a pretty long way. Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm going to do it a couple different ways. <laughs> you get my breath. Yeah, of course you do. Um, so, case no, test number one. Take a kernel, put it on the tip of the pickle, as so, and then take a bite of the pickle. Hey, did I tell you you could fall off that freaking pickle? You stay freaking butt on top of the freaking pickle, you freaking stupid candy corn.
What the frick was that? <laughs> let's do it. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Confirmation. What the frick was that? I don't know what that was. I don't know what that was. But it was weird. It was so weird. Uh, so, let me, let me describe the events that just unfolded. So, I took a bite of the pickle and the candy corn. And they were doing their own thing in their own world, okay? But then they started getting closer and closer. And you would think, oh, they're gonna merge. They're gonna do like this. No, they did this. They beat the crap out of each other. I I feel like I had a freaking World War II going on in my mouth. What? Uh. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I'll give that part. That part gets a three. But we have another way. We have another way. Also, side note, don't punch your hands over and over again. My hands don't feel good right now. They don't feel good right now. You stupid. <clears throat> so, the second way. These spears are going to die because they don't have juice saturating them anymore. But that's okay. It's all for the video. It's all for the cause. So we're going to grab... A handful of kernels. Like, I think that's an appropriate number. That's like, rip. That's like eight or so. Kernels. I'm going to put them in a mini fridge right here that you probably can't see. And we will check in in those BS. And then we will come up with a final rating based off of that. So stay tuned. Buenos noches. Two days later. Hola, por favor. It has been two days since the last part of this video, which means the candy corn has been pickling for two days. And we're about to try it. Now, disclaimer. I have not formally smelled the, the the solution yet, but um, when I open the fridge to get other things out, the other things faintly smell like pickle because pickle has a very strong and distinctive smell, and it infects everything in in the vicinity. So let us see. Like when I get my freaking chop of milk out, it smells faintly like pickle juice, but that's okay. Oh, we have a bit of an issue that I did not consider. Um, this is frozen. But just the top is. The bottom is it. Interesting. Um... The candy corn, to my surprise, I should I shouldn't be surprised about this, but I'm surprised about it. I wasn't expecting it. Is gone. It's just orange liquid. Orange liquid. So I was gonna eat them, but they're not there. So cheers. Oh god, that is putrid. Disgusting! <laughs> uh, I might actually throw up. Give me some. <sighs> oh, this is blue raspberry lemonade from Applebee's. Coming in clutch. Coming in clutch. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. 
That was not pleasant at all. That was one of the worst things I've ever tried. That part gets a zero. Averaging the two together will bring the total to a 1.5 out of 10. If you want to torture yourself, try this. But if you don't, then don't. It's as simple as that. This does not tickle. Candy corn is okay on its own. Maybe you like it a lot. I don't, personally. With pickle. In mixture, specifically. <coughs> it is so bad. Thank you for watching. I'm Mr. Pickle. <laughs> I'm going to be recovering for a little while. Thank you. Goodbye.